Good day and peace be with you. Today is Thursday, the 9th of February 2023. Let us pray. Father Lord, we thank you for gracing us with another day. Father Lord, there are many things happening in the world which fill us with sorrow and lead us to ask the question why. The key one at the moment being the earthquake at Turkey. Father, we bring all of those people affected into your lives. That's Turkey and Syria. We ask you, dear Lord Father, to comfort them. We ask you, dear Lord Father, to pull as many as you can to safety. We can question, dear Lord Father, but we don't have the answers. All we can say, dear Lord Father, that it is in your hand and in your own time, according to your will, you will make it all well. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Our reading for Reflection Day continues from the book of Judges, chapter 14, verses 1 to 9. And the theme for reflection that we have today is One day Samson went to Timnah. Beloved in Christ, let us listen to the word of the Lord. Samson went down to Timnah and saw there a young Philistine woman. When he returned, he said to his father and mother, I have seen a Philistine woman in Timnah. Now get her for me as my wife. His father and mother replied, Isn't there an acceptable woman among your relatives or among our people? Must you go to the uncircumcised Philistines to get a wife? But Samson said to his father, Get her for me. She's the right one for me. His parents did not know that this was from the Lord, who was seeking an occasion to confront the Philistines, for at that time they were ruling over Israel. Samson went down to Timnah together with his father and mother. As they approached the vineyards of Timnah, suddenly a young lion came roaring toward him. The Spirit of the Lord came powerfully upon him, so that he tore the lion apart with his bare hands, as he might have torn a young goat. But he told neither his father nor his mother what he had done. Then he went down and talked with the woman, and he liked her. Some time later, when he went back to marry her, he turned aside to look at the lion's carcass, and in it he saw a swarm of bees and some honey. He scooped out the honey with his hands and ate as he went along. When he rejoined his parents, he gave them some, and they too ate it. But he did not tell them that he had taken the honey from the lion's carcass. Here ends our reading for today. Thanks be to God. Remember to share the good news with others. It's your way of evangelizing. Draw them to Christ. Encourage them in Christ. And also remember to subscribe to the I Love Presby channel. Have a blessed day. Amen.